Yes, people, welcome back to another video. So today I'm gonna to be showing you guys what a brand new C100V3 looks like. Now, before I show you guys, big thank you to Collective Bikes for sending me this bike. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and let's show you the bike. Now, the color I chose is the black and yellow one. It's personally my favorite one. The only thing that doesn't come stock with this bike is this Collective Bike seat. It will come with a mountain bike saddle, but just for today, I thought I'd put the wheelie seat on just because I want to do some combos on it. So first things first, you're going to get these Collective Bike grips, the same ones that come on the C2. They do come with Shimano MT200 brakes. Obviously, they do come with a front one as well, but that will be taken off soon. We got Collective branded stem with Collective branded bars as well, which I think looks really nice. I might upgrade the bars and get some wider ones and some higher rise, but they're definitely some good bars to start off with. The new Collective logo is actually on the front of the frame as well, which I think looks really clean. Now I've ridden this bike for about 15 minutes and the suspension does feel nice. You can actually lock it and unlock it as well, which is quite cool. The tires are gonna look like this. I don't know the name of them, but I think I will be putting some hookworms on this bike. Front wheels also quick release, so it's easy to take on and off if you like to do no front wheel. Now the detail on the frame I think is absolutely insane. It's so well designed so much thought going into it as well and I think it looks really cool. You're gonna get yourself some nice Shimano Dior cranks with a Holotech bottom bracket as well. The pedals, there's some Welgo pedals. I think they're definitely gonna be something to upgrade. And this is how you know it's fresh out of the box. It's still got the sticker on. Got the new Collective logo on the back of the frame as well. It does come with a quick release seat clamp, which is nice and easy to get your seat on and off. And if you wanna change the height of it as well. Even further down on the frame as well, the attention to detail is actually crazy on this bike. Now you're gonna get a Shimano Dior derailleur with a 10 speed cassette. And also the gear shifter is also Shimano Dior as well. The back tire is gonna be the same as the front. I think I'm definitely gonna get some hookworms for it. And I'm not too sure whether to keep the dock disc on or off at the moment. This is what the bike looks like the other way around as well. Again, thank you to Collective Bikes for sending me this bike. There's gonna be some crazy content coming on this as well. I'm gonna do some upgrades as well. So I'll definitely make a video when I do upgrade this bike a little bit. Ooh. 